Howdy, how y'all doing this evening? <laughs> I want to tell you a little story about one of my ex-wives again. <laughs> I was taking a shower one morning, you know, a nice relaxing hot shower. I'd been in there maybe five minutes. She got to hollering at me, telling me that the garbage disposal had kicked off again, a little reset button on it. She said, come reset it. I said, I'm in the shower. She said, well, you know where the button is, and it won't take you but a second to come push it. And I said, why don't you push it? She said, I'm scared of it. <sighs> she said, it won't take you but just a second. Come on. So I got out of the shower, mad. I said, well, since it's that big of an emergency, I won't even dry off. And I walked in the kitchen naked and wet, dripping all over the floor. And from the look I gave her, she didn't say anything about it. I took me a deep breath and sighed real hard and looked at her, and I opened up the cabinet underneath the sink, and I crawled up underneath there. What I didn't know was her new little Siamese kitten that was about four months old was stalking me. Standing back around the corner peeking. Did you know that cats are attracted to dangly things? Well, just about the time I climbed up underneath that sink and was reaching around trying to find that button, I found the button and I went to push it. And about that time, the cat helped itself to the new toys that I had unwillingly gave it. Well, you know... Mother Nature kind of instilled in the animals the fight or flight deal. In a situation like that, it's flight. So, I lost control of all my body motions, and I tried to go through the sink and through the roof. The sink stopped me. It won. And when I woke up, <clears throat> I was laying in the kitchen floor, almost dry. She was standing over me, along with three paramedics that were trying their best to control the laughter because she had already filled them in on what happened. And they weren't doing too good a job of it. <coughs> so the next day, I get up and I go to work. Heads all bandaged up. People that I work with, what happened, man? What happened? What happened to your head? What happened to your head? What happened to your head? I just ignored them because I was not going to tell them what happened. And then the boss came by, looked at me and he said, Tommy, what happened to your head? And I just looked at him with a glazed over look. He said, what's the matter? Cat got your tongue? And that's when the fight started. <laughs>